CBSE 10 Maths. Hey guys, this is Tina. I teach CBSE 8 Maths. Check out our videos on the playlist. Alright, now let's get into the video. Today we are going to be learning Chapter 5, Arithmetic Progressions, Exercise 5.3, Third Question, Fifth and Sixth Subdivision. Alright, now let's read the question. In an AP, given D is equal to 5, Yes, 9 is equal to 75. Find A and A9. So, this is the fifth subdivision. Alright. So, here we have D value. Uh, yes, 9 value. That is 75. We have to find the A and A9 value. Alright. So, here I will just write it. Then only it will be easy. Okay. So, D is 5. And yes, 9 is 75. So, here the N value is 9. Okay. Why? Because here yes, 9. So, in the place of 9, we have to, you guys know, right? Yes, n value. So, the n value is 9. We have to find a value and a 9 value. Alright. So, to find it, let us apply the yes, n formula. Yes, n is equal to n by 2 bracket 2a plus n minus 1 into d. Alright guys, so now we can substitute the values. So here yes n, let us write yes as it is. And here we know the n value, right? That is 9. And here the n value is 9 divided by uh, 2 and bracket 2 into a value we don't know. Plus uh, here the n value is 9 and minus 1 as it is. Uh, d value, it is 5. Alright, so now yes 9 value is 75 is equal to 9 by 2 bracket 2a plus 9 minus 1 is 8 bracket means multiplication 5 and here yes 5. So since it is in, uh, so since we have 9 divided by 2 no, so when it comes to this side here the 2 will become multiplication. And here 9 it will go down. Why? Well, because it is division. Okay. Since here no, it is in this form when it comes to this side, it changes into division. Is equal to 2a and 8 into 5 is 45. Alright. So here we can actually cancel the values. Um, 3 3s are 9 and 3 2s are it is 6 and balance 1. 5 3s are it is 15. Perfect. So, when we just multiply them, I will solve here, okay. So, 25 into 2 is 50 divided by 3 is equal to 2a plus 4. Twice so here it is 40, okay. Alright. So, when we get when we get this 40 to that side, it changes into minus 40 is equal to 2a. Alright. So, here now uh, nothing is there means 1. So, when we just take LCM here, we will get 50 minus 120 divided by 3 is equal to 2a. Alright. So, when we just subtract it, we will get minus 70 by 3 is equal to 2a. Alright guys. So, now we got something like this, isn't it? So, here we'll write the minus 70 divided by 3 as it is. So, here it is 2 into a. So, since it is in multiplication, when it comes to this side, it changes into division okay and is equal to a all right so now we can actually cancel it 1 1 2 is 2 and 3 2 is 8 is 6 5 2 is 10 so it's going to be minus 35 minus 35 divided by 3 is equal to a so this is the a value okay all right. So since uh, since you guys know, finally we got the a value, but we have to find the a nine value. Okay. So I'll just find it here. So a nine now we can actually write it as a nine is equal to a plus eight d. Okay. All right. So now what we can do is now we can write a nine is equal to a value is minus thirty five by three and plus eight as it is into d value is 5 a a9 is equal to 
minus 35 by 3 plus 8 5 are it is 40. Here nothing is there means 1 and A9 is equal to take LCM. So, when we just take LCM we will get minus 35 plus 120 divided by 3. Okay. So, after subtracting it we will get 85 by 3. All right. So, finally we got a value here. So, this is our answer. Okay. So, this is the A9 value. Okay. So, according to the question we found the A9 value as well as the A value. Okay. Right, guys. So, now let us solve the sixth subdivision. So, according to the sixth subdivision we have A value, D value, SN value but we have to find the N value and A N value. Alright. So, now let us find the n value and the a n value. First of all here we have s n value. So, let us apply s n formula. So, s n is equal to n by 2 bracket 2 a plus n minus 1 into d. So, here the s n value is 90 is equal to so n as it is divided by 2 as it is bracket. So, 2 into a value is 2 plus n value we do not know. So, n as it is minus 1 as it is and the d value is 8. Perfect. So, now we can actually uh, get this to this side. So, when we get 2 to this side it changes into multiplication and is equal to n as it is bracket 2 to the 4 and here we can write plus as it is and here we have n minus 1 bracket 8. So, 8 into n is 8n and minus 1 into 8 is minus 8 close the bracket. So, 90 into 2 is 180 is equal to n and then here we have 4 and minus 8 those are our uh, numbers is not it I mean constant numbers. So, here 4 minus 8. So, when we just subtract them we will get We will get minus 4. So, here we can write this 8 in first. Okay. All right. I hope you can understand. Okay. I just wrote this 8 in variable term at first and when I just subtracted them I got minus 4. Why? Because 8 is the greatest number. That is why minus. Perfect. So, now we can write 180 is equal to n into 8 in is 8 n square and n into minus 4 is minus 4 n. Alright, so when I just look at it carefully, so here if I just get this 180 to this side, then it changes into minus 180, okay, and then is equal to 0. Alright, so, so here in everything now we have 4 as common. So let us take 4 as common. So 4 2s are it is 8 and n square as it is, and then 4 minus n is so, 4 into minus n is minus 4 n and then minus if I just write 45. So, 4, 4 into minus 45 is minus 180 okay. and then close the bracket is equal to 0. Alright. So, now we can write 2 n square minus n minus 45 is equal to 0. So, finally we got a quadratic equation after taking it as common is not it. So, since we got in quadratic equation let us solve it how we how we solved it in fourth chapter no like that we will let us solve it right over here. First of all multiply the first uh, number and the last number here we have to take only the coefficients ok. So, 2 into 45 so 2 into 45 when we just multiply it I will get 90 ok. So, remember one more thing the signs are really important ok. So, here we have minus sign. So, here it is minus 45 is not it. So, 2 into minus 45 is minus 90 perfect. So, now what we have to do is we have to find the factors for 90 ok. So, for now forget about the sign ok. First of all let us find the factors for 90. So, 4 to are 8 and 5 to are 10 and then 3 1 3 is 3, 5 3 is 15 and 3, 5 3 is it is 15 and 1 5 is 5 ok. Alright, so here these are the factors for 90. 
so here if I just take these both like this and here I have 5 and 2 isn't it so when I just multiply 3 into 3 it is 9 and 5 into 2 is 10 isn't it so why did I do like this why because here after multiplying the first and the last term we got minus 90 after finding the factors for 90 uh, when you just take the numbers here we have 3 into 3 both are similar values so 3 3 is a 9 5 into 2 is 10 so now whatever factors we got now here we got 9 and 10 as the factor for 90 okay so here when we just add or subtract we have to get the middle term so here the middle term is uh, the coefficient for n is 1 isn't it so it is minus 1 so when we just add when we just add or subtract we should get minus 1 okay how how much we have to add the factors or subtract the factors for this um, 90 okay so here I got 9 and 10 these are the two numbers I got when I just took uh, factors okay so here when I just add it I will get 19 isn't it in similarly if I just subtract it I will get minus 90 Thank you guys for watching this video. Please like this video, share it to your friends and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you have any doubt, comment me in the comment section. Catch you in the next video. Bye.